What's going on, YouTube fishing fam? It's your boy Has back at it again after a long hiatus. It's been a while since I posted up a video on my YouTube channel. Not for lack of trying, I just haven't had the time to go fishing. I've been really busy. Obviously, you know, COVID times, everything, pandemic is getting crazier, it's getting more hectic, and you know, I got a uh, just turned uh, recently just turned one year old in the house. I've been spending a lot of time with and all that, so it's just been hard to find time to get out and go fishing. But just got a phone call interrupting my video. But today I'm going to DC and I'm going catfishing, something I haven't done in a while. Also, haven't catfished in a while in DC. Um, I cannot wait. Um, I appreciate all the support, even though I haven't posted up a video in two months. I still be getting subscribers, still be getting comments, still getting a lot of views on all my old videos. I appreciate the support, I appreciate the grind, I appreciate you guys because without you, there is no me. And hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and yeah, we're gonna get on some fish today. Now, um, I'm gonna drop this video first before I drop other videos that I do have in my backlog. Just haven't been putting those out because I just wanna make sure that I can stay consistent and stay steady for you guys. I don't wanna just put up a video here and then put up another video there in another week or I mean another month or something. I wanna have a nice consistent like, you know, seasonal episodes for you guys. So even if I don't do something for two months, but then I can drop something for you guys and do something every two weeks for the next two months. Like that's the plan. So we're gonna be out here grinding on this winter catfish bite. Obviously, you know, it's winter time, bass, not a lot of bass fishing. Haven't been bass fishing in a while. And I probably ain't gonna go bass fishing just cause it's cold and the bass don't bite in the cold out here. Like, um, I mean, I could try, I might go out all day and then catch one and probably get skunked most of the time. So catfishing, yeah, it's plentiful. Carp, probably do some carp fishing too. Haven't done carp fishing in a while. Um, I'm also going up to Deep Creek this weekend. Um, I'm gonna try to do some fishing. I'll probably get out for a couple hours there. Um, but as you know, Deep Creek, huge lake, and it's cold there as well. But they do have pike and chain pickerel. They still hit the cold, so I might be able to get on some of those. But we're just gonna see, because it just all depends. We got a cabin up there. Hopefully it has a dock that I can fish off of, buy some minnows, set up my, you know, shop and um, not bringing the kayak because it's way too cold. I ain't getting in the water, bro. Nah, I'm not doing that. It is like 20, 20 degrees. It's snowing up there right now. So just not. I will get in the boat, but I ain't getting in the kayak, man. Forget that. So yeah, stay tuned. Let's get out here. Let me get on some fish. It's enough rapping. Time to see how life catch them. All right, you guys made it out to a new spot. First cast going out. Gotcha. What's up? Nah, not yet. I was just pulling in the slack, so this one no. Run over that one. All right, guys, we got the first fish on. This one went off about five minutes prior. It's nothing big, but we're gonna get them in. Yep. Yeah, little guy. This is the smallest catfish I've caught in a while. Little guy. Baby blue. Hooked right in the bottom. This is probably like the one. What's that? Baby blue. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you? Little baby blue, first fish of the day. Not bad. Let 
let him go. Woo! Go back the other way. Turn around. There you go. Nope, turn around. Gotta turn around and go the other way, my guy. All right, guys, we got a bigger run now. This one's a little bigger. Oh, he just dropped it. Damn it. He just dropped that one. That one was a little bit bigger too. Yep. All right, something just picked this up. I think he might have dropped it. Yeah. Got it? Oh, wait, hold up. Ah. Yes, sir. We on. <laughs> this one feels better. This one feels better. This one feels better. Oh, yeah, he's coming on in. Go double up. Doubling up. Another baby. Bigger, bigger than biggest one so far though. But he's still small. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right now just catfish. He dropped it. Yeah, biggest one. Okay. The the babies are eating right now. But hey, I'm not mad. <laughs> They're biting. So we got another one. Okay. A little bit bigger. Let's get a release on this guy. Been out here about 30 minutes. He's about five pounds. Just gonna let him go right here. He's gonna get he's gonna get himself together out there come on bucko there he goes there he realizes he's in the water now I believe so Yep, on again. Just the little ones coming out today. I'm on a pocket of baby ones over there. Yeah, yeah, he might have. Yeah, Let's let this guy go. Let's see, hope this one's a, oh. Oh, this one. Yeah, oh yeah, this is a better run. Good luck riding right, right. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, did he drop it? Yeah. He dropped it. All right, we're on again. 
with another baby guy. I've just found a honey hole of them over here. My left ride has been going off all day. I haven't got anything on my other ride. Just this little guy. Come on in, bucko. There you go. Yeah, we could have filled the total with all these little ones that took it off of there. I think 50 cents or a dollar a pound for a tote full of fish. Hey, we, we could have got some happy hour money. <laughs> Damn, really? Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Just gotta run on this left rod again. This has been the whole time, but I think he might have dropped it. Yeah, he dropped it. This left ride all day been going off. All right, just had a hook up on my boy's ride. Let's see if some just had a bite over here. Let's see if something's on it. Ah. Nah. He dropped it. Another one dropped it. Big run. Big run. Oh, this is a better fish, y'all. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> About time we got a good one. <sighs> there we go. I'm feeling them head shakes. Oh, yeah. This is a better fish, y'all. This is a better fish. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm feeling them head shakes. Oh, he's already popped up. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, there we go. There we go. About time we got a good one. He's probably 20. I'm hoping. All right. Let me bring him over this way. Let's bring this guy over here. There we go. Decent size. Uh, he might be 20. Ah, get off. He's getting wrapped up. There we go. There we go. Better size, better size, better size. Come on in, big girl. Right here in the bottom of the mouth. Whoo! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We got a better one.
Sit you right here for a second. I gotta get some stuff set up so I can get a good picture of your girl. And get a weight on you. I knew it was only a matter of time before the big girl started hitting. It was perfect conditions. I knew high tide was gonna be coming in shortly. And there we go. Finally got the big girl. Let me get this set up so I can. So I can get a good. Good picture of her. guys we finally got a good one let me pick her up real quick and let me clean her off all right guys we finally got a good one Woo. there we go y'all we got a good one right here I'll get you all in the frame guys <laughs> It's a good one. Whoo, okay. Just that 20, 21. Getting the weight on it real quick. Looks like we're at 20. Looks like we're at 20. I'm gonna call it 21. There we go, y'all. Got a nice little 20 pound. Hey, just the time, man. Yep. Nice, nice 20 pounder. Yeah. I just, I just weighed him on the scale. 20 pounds. Definitely did. <laughs> so when you left, my left one went off, they dropped it. And then your right one went off, they dropped it. And then about five minutes ago, this guy just hit. He took off running. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Looks like we're at 20. I'm gonna call it 21. Let's go. Oh, I think he dropped it. Yeah. Right. Come on, baby girl. Let's go let you go. Let's let you go. There we go. There she goes. All right, you guys, that's going to do it for today's episode. I want to give a big, huge shout out to my new friend, um, Cat Fisherman out of D.C. I'm not going to give his name, but he's very knowledgeable. Uh, took me to a spot that, of course, I'm not going to disclose. You may recognize it, but if you if you comment where it is at, I'm going to delete it. So don't do it. All right. But. 
Man, shout out to him, man. Definitely had fun. I was just going to a spot that I, you know, I normally go to. Somebody I'm that I just met today for the first time was there, and we got to chat. And he's like, "Hey, man, you want to go to another spot? I'll, you know, I'll show you." But I was like, "Blah." One thing led to another. We ended up going to another spot, man. Real cool dude, man. Um, he's he didn't want to be on camera, so I'm gonna keep him off camera. He's not gonna be in none of the shots that you guys see. Um, but man, overall, it was a great day. Um, numbers wise, we did. We caught a bunch of fish. You're not gonna see any of his catches. Only you're gonna see my catches. But I caught about was five or six myself. He caught another five. Um, it was a great day though, man. I definitely had a good time. Definitely just get back out there on the water. It's been s such a long time. Um, and I will be back out next week. And stay tuned for that. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Has life. I'm out. Peace.